Hey guys, happy Memorial Day, happy Monday. And first off, sorry about my voice, um, but um, this is a classic tradition in CrossFit is the workout Murph. This is um, a longer workout, something to challenge yourself. Again, to remember that uh, those that made the ultimate sacrifice. So it's a hard workout, but we hopefully you'll get a chance to do the entire thing. Well, of course you can scale it. We'll talk about the options and approaches to this workout. So it is a mile run followed by 100 pull-ups, 200 push-ups, 300 squats, and then a mile run. If you have a weight vest, you wear it, okay? So again, of course, uh, everyone doesn't have their own weight vest. For most people, they'll do this with no weight vest and that's hard enough. The mile at each end, all right, is up to you. Again, if a mile is too, too much, you can scale that distance down to something that's challenging for you. Um, and then the work in the middle, all right? There's basically two approaches that people take for this. Uh, one is to break it up into multiple rounds. The most common approach is 20 rounds of five pull-ups, 10 push-ups, 15 squats, all right? And that'll equal 100, 200, 300. Now there's another version where you do all 100 push-ups or all 100 pull-ups first, all 200 push-ups and all 300 squats in a row. That's gonna take you a little bit longer and be a little more challenging. But again, that's personal preference, all right, for how you approach it. The goal here though, these simple movements perform with good standards. So for our push-ups, um, or sorry, for our pull-ups, you can use a band, you could do ring rows. Uh, just make sure you get full range of motion every single time. If you're brand new, do something that's easy, that you can get your chin over the bar. Um, and I recommend breaking this up into the 20 rounds of five pull-ups per round, again, to ensure that you can be safe on your arms and your hands and move through it with a little bit of intensity, okay? Uh, the push-ups is probably the biggest challenge for most people, our arms fail very quickly. So we wanna make sure that every rep, our chest touches the ground and we get good extension at the top, okay? We can make this easier by elevating our hands, okay? This is a classic scale, okay? The higher our hands go, the easier that's gonna be. Um, again, you might have to go down to single repetitions on this. It's a lot of push-ups, and uh, again, we wanna see that those good standards, all right? The squats, same thing, very basic movement. You wanna get a good, deep squat, stand up all the way, every single rep. We see often when people get tired is that they'll lock their knees, but never open the hip. It's important to stand up all the way at the top every single time, so this is not a good rep, okay? Even if you feel burning in your quads, you gotta stand up all the way, all right? So um, that's the basics today, guys, so have fun with it, and I hope you enjoy your holiday, and we'll see you tomorrow.